titratable acidity of milk. Before beginning our experiment, let us see the theoretical portion of it. What is the acidity contained or acid content of the milk? We all know that most of the components or the food items contains acid in small or large quantities naturally. So milk has no exception. Milk naturally contains acid that is lactic acid which is formed due to microbial action or other such physical or biological reactions. Acid content of fresh milk ranges from 0.1 to 0.7 percent. मतलब जो fresh milk होता है that is directly obtained from the milking animal and has not achieved a life span of more than one or two days has a natural acid content of 0.1 to 0.7 percent and it increases with time as milk gets older because हम सबको पता है कि milk के अंदर microbial action होगा जिसके कारण milk के अंदर जो carbohydrate जो sugar है that is lactose that would be converted into lactic acid so, as much milk will grow, the acidity of the milk will increase the acid content. Most of the time, you must have observed at your homes also, that if you have a bad milk in your house, or if we have a bad milk in our house, or if we have a bad milk in our house, then it seems to be a bad milk in our house. That bad milk or that acidity is because of microbial action. So, acidity or the acid content of milk is very important to determine its quality. Fresh milk should have less acid content and should be sweeter, not sour. Therefore, it becomes very necessary and equally important to determine the acid content in milk. So, let us see how do we do it. So, as you can see on your screens, it is again a type of titration. First of all, we need to take the milk sample. हम एक बीकर में milk sample को लेंगे given volume के amount में, उसको incubate करेंगे तब तक वो एक required temperature ना achieve करे. Generally, the required temperature is 37 degrees Celsius. After this, we will add a few drops of indicator. Indicator यानी वो chemical जो कि हमारी reaction की completion को indicate करेगा. And in this case, we will using phenol ethylene. Phenol ethylene basic medium में pink color देता है. हम slowly और gradually titrate करेंगे milk sample को 0.1 molar sodium hydroxide यानी NaOH सॉल्यूशन के साथ तब तक जब तक कि एक पेल पिंक कलर ऑप्टेन नहीं होता एंड जैसा भी एक पेल पिंक कलर ऑप्टेन हो वी विल टेक इट एस द एंड पॉइंट ऑफ आर टाइटेशन एंड कैलकुलेट द अमाउंट ऑफ एसिड कंटेंट सो दिस वाज ऑल अबाउट आर एक्सपेरिमेंट थ्योरेटिकल पार्ट लेट अस सी हाउ वी परफॉर्म इट So let us see what all we need for our experiment that is determination of acidity in milk. We all know that uh, pH is very important for the stability and shelf life of milk. So we have taken our milk sample. We took around 25 ml of the milk sample and the volume can be changed but the calculation would differ. And next we need an indicator that is phenolphthalein indicator. For titration we are using the 0.1 normal solution of sodium hydroxide which we filled in this 25 ml burette. So I would add a few drops of indicator that is phenolphthalein in this sample we will gently mix it and titrate against sodium hydroxide until a pale pink color is obtained. As you can see, it has got a pale pink color. We see it against this. You can observe it, and uh, our reading comes is coming out to be around 5.8 ml. And just to ensure that the titration is completed, uh, after noting the reading, we will add just the two or three more drops to get a more intense color. Yes. 
you can see it has got a more intense color and this completes our neutralization of acid present in the milk and by this volume which we obtain in the buret that is 5.6 we would calculate the acidity and the standard should be uh, from 6.2 to 6.5 range it is slightly acidic in nature